to my attention. I forgot to talk about rounding and sig figs. So let's, let's just do a real quick, like, two minute on that. So here's a big, giant, stupid number. And if I want to round this, now here's the part that everybody has an easy time with. If I need to round this to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 sig figs. Well, that's ridiculously easy. 5, 9, 8, 2, 0, 7, 1, 5. Okay, good. Nobody has a problem rounding after the decimal. You round based on what comes next. And on top of that, you're rounding. Now, your physics book is going to give you this weird rule where if the number after it is a 5, you look to the next number, and if it's odd, you go up and even, you go down, or vice versa. That's supposed to even out your rounding. I don't do that. I just say 5 goes up <laughs> and under 5 goes down. Is it technically accurate? No, probably not. And if you go on to a course with physics or math, somebody may tell you the other more complicated rule, and that's good. Listen to them. I am simplifying it for you, okay, because we're not building a rocket to Mars, so it's okay to do that for us. What if I have to round up here? So let's say I have to round this to three sig figs. Okay, I'm rounding to here. I'm rounding based on that. Five, nine, eight, two. Whoops. No. <laughs> Five, nine, eight, zero, 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 zero. Okay, three sig figs. But I think the question you've got is this. What if I have to round this? Well, first, let's, let's take this question. What if I have to round it to two sig figs? Yeah, what if I do have to round it to two sig figs? Ooh. Well, two sig figs would have me rounding it to here. Okay, well, that's easy. So to two sig figs. Well, I'm rounding this number based on that number. Easy peasy, right? But that rounds up to 10, and I, I can't, wait. Which means you round up the next number. You do round up the next number. So that gets you 6.0. Well, okay, it gets you, here's the second tricky part. It gets you 6.0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. What's the problem? It's one sig fig. How can you make that two sig figs? There's only one way. Scientific notation is the only way to make that answer into two sig figs. Because in scientific notation, everything that is shown is considered to be significant. So this would become six point, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six point zero times ten to the sixth, six million. Okay. It's the only way to show that correctly in scientific notation. And yes, it does round to six point zero.